An oleball, Dutch pronunciation, o libel, plural oleoballen, also olikook, is a traditional Dutch and Belgian food. They are called oleoballen, literally, oil balls, in the Netherlands, while in Belgium they are also called smotoballen, literally, lard balls although the real smout is of rapeseed oil, and kroustelens, loosely, crispies, in French. In English they are more commonly known as Dutch donuts or duchies. In the distant region of Istria, now split into the countries of Italy, Croatia and Slovenia, a variation of this dish is called fritole, fritule and blintsi. In Serbia they are called krofni. Also, in Ghana, West Africa, they are known locally as bofro or boflot. Description Oleoballen are a variety of dumpling made by using an ice cream scoop or two spoons to scoop a certain amount of dough and dropping the dough into a deep fryer filled with hot oil. In this way, a sphere-shaped oleoball emerges. Oleoballen are traditionally eaten on New Year's Eve and at funfairs. In wintertime, they are also sold in the street at mobile stalls. The dough is made from flour, eggs, yeast, some salt, milk, baking powder and usually sultanas, currants, raisins and sometimes zest or succade, candied fruit. A notable variety is the apple beignet which contains only a slice of apple, but different from oleoballen, the dough should not rise for at least an hour. Oleoballen are usually served with powdered sugar. In Flanders the oleball is also called smoothball because it is often cooked in animal fat rather than vegetable oil. Another difference between the Dutch oleball and the Flemish smootball is that the smootball is usually not filled in contrast to the Dutch oleball. The filling of the oleball could consist of raisins, currants and apple. Other ingredients can be added, such as succade, pieces of orange or whipped cream. Origin they are said to have been first eaten by Germanic tribes in the Netherlands during the Yule, the period between December 26 and January 6 where such baked goods were used. The earliest discovered recipe of oleokokan, oil cookies, the direct precursor of the oleball came from the 1667 Dutch book De Verstandige Kok, the smart, responsible cook. Variations From oleokok to oleball. For centuries the Dutch ate oleokok, oil cookie, an old name for oleball, oil ball. The oleoballen you see in the painting from around 1652 are very similar to today's oleball. At that time, they were baked in lard or rapeseed oil. During the 19th century the word, oleball, started to be used more. The 1868 edition of the Van Dale Dictionary included word oleball, whereas the rival Wardenboek der Nederland Chital didn't include it until 1896, stating that oleokok is a more commonly used term, but a major shift in usage occurred. From the early 20th century, the word oleball became the popular word, while oleokok was no longer in use. Kraustelens A very similar type of oleball can also be found in the Walloon part of Belgium, Brussels and northern France. Kraustelens are deep-fried dough balls served hot and liberally sprinkled with powdered sugar. They are usually served in a paper cone with a little plastic fork to eat them with. They are typically found at fairgrounds in Belgium and in Lille, France. Oleoballentist Contest since 1993 Dutch newspaper Algemeen Dagblad has held an annual highly publicized oleoballentist at the end of each year. In 2012, the bakery of Willy Oling from Marsen won the test. In 2013 Richard Visser won the test for the ninth time in 20 years which is currently the record for the highest number of wins by one person. See also List of donut varieties Poffergies Vetkik Donut Fritter Abliskiver, a similar Danish dish. References External links 
Media related to Oleball at Wikimedia Commons